All right, so Emily, so what we're doing, and all of you guys, what we're doing is we're about to walk in to the actual protest. Um, this is out in the parking lot. Away from here. Right, so now we're about to go in. It looks good now, but you guys need to share this out because we're about to walk in. We've heard chants, all kinds of shit. Yeah, there's so a lot of people out. In. You guys are about to see this, it. We're going to keep this as uninterrupted as possible. Is there a way that we can turn that light on when it gets dark enough? I wonder. Turn the flash on? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't remember how to do that. Oh, there's a bump.
Oh yeah, they're waiting. Yeah, Josh behind me. Yeah. Yeah, yours nothing you can do about that. I see a pocket. I'm going right into the pocket. All right, man. No middle fingers. Peace signs on. Yep, yep, that's right. Sir, sir. Yes, sir. Remember, guys, stay calm because it's they're about to start yelling and all that. So. We're going to be labeled every name in the book. Won't be the first time. Yeah. Sure as hell won't be the last, either. Like not to you all from Saturday. <laughs> Two officers need to get in. We got you. Here. I got you. Officers, look. Make sure you got eye contact with the ones behind you. Good thing that's a Spread out. Spread it out further. Get eye contact, guys. Man, I'm trying to take your fish. Here we go. So here's the thing I want you guys to understand. We're about to pray. You don't have to get that close. We're about to pray. And and there isn't one Nazi symbol here. There isn't one Nazi symbol here. Just I want everybody to understand. Amen.
Amen. So guys, why don't you do a nice little circle around? And yes, there was um, there are people here with their babies and everything else, and their small children because they're. started was to bring clean. Then it got hijacked by Antifa. We're not really even going to talk about them that much. We're already doing them all. Yes, Marcus, they are. They don't not just want this money. They do not want the border. And I don't see a single one.
So as you can see, there's about 30 to 50 of us, maybe. And there's got to be, if I had a guess, 2,500 to 3,000 of them. The police are out here putting all of their lives at risk. So for all of you people that may have something to say about the cops, remember, they're out here right now. They could easily get run. They could. Every single one of them. So they're out here protecting us and our rights just to stand here for a memorial. Okay? Because yes, that memorial means something, but in the end, it's just an inanimate object. And these people are putting blood, they're putting blood and they're putting souls in uh, harm's way. Now they're about to erect a flag. These guys in front of us are nice and ginned up, the ones behind us aren't really. Tell you what, I'm actually happy that they're out here. I can't stand all the cursing and all that, but you know, and all the uh, the name calling just for the sake of name calling, but I'm happy that they're out here because they, they wouldn't be out here today without the blood of the people that Simon Sam represented in the first place. They wouldn't be out here if it wasn't for all the blood of the military and the cops and everybody else that fights to protect their rights. Yeah, exactly. Look, I did you have something you wanted to say? Okay. Because if you do it's like the fact that they're out there chanting and stand up and fight back. Yeah. That's what we're doing. Yes, yeah, exactly. right. So I feel like they're cheering us along. Right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they are. They should understand that they're they're the fascists and they should stand up and fight back against actual fascism. And then the thing is, like I'm looking around and I'm seeing Kids. These aren't even adults. These aren't even college students. They're kids that and they're playing, they don't even and know they're, what they're doing. And they're playing rap that has nothing but person. You guys 
is make sure that you share this out. You put it on your timelines. You invite all your friends. You do everything you can. This is what it's all about. And here's the statue. There it is right there. And look, the Silent Sam statue represented the North and the South. It, it was pointed towards the North, and it had a depiction of a student that was leaving everything behind. It wasn't just the South. It was both. And these people don't even know their history, but they're going to accuse us of not knowing our history. And I mean, we even have Santa Claus here. I said, we even have Santa Claus here. <laughs> A good, you got a good uh, look at that green sign right there, right? Burn down the American plantation. KKK. The, 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 the KKK represents maybe 3% of our entire population. They don't want to burn down the KKK. They want to burn down America. Yep. Anybody that wears an American flag is considered a Nazi. We're all Americans here. Not a single one of us is KKK. But hey. I mean, look at this. They're dancing to an anarchist song. Like, really? I don't even know what I'm listening to. You did get these songs, right? I did. I did, a few times. Hashtag, save our monuments. So, so we're out here. We're out here in TC Media, literally just covering this, right? We're not really here with any group, but Act Back is here. They're the ones that are throwing the song. And honestly, this is how bad it is. We couldn't even get in here. Okay, we couldn't even get in here if it wasn't for the fact that we came in with this group because they were getting police escorted. Anybody with an American flag, or God forbid, a rebel flag, or anything like that, that decides to venture out of these gates without a police escort is going to get their asses stopped. That's how bad it is in this in this country right now. These kids that don't know any better are gonna sit here and tell us, free Americans, that we can't venture out of this gate. Now we're not going to because we're not stupid. They outnumber us at least fifty to one, honestly. Okay? And we're not and we're not stupid. We're not about to do that. And thank God for these police officers. Honestly, thank God for these police officers, because we'd be dead without it. But I want you guys to see this. Nobody here is cursing. Nobody here is putting up a middle finger. There are zero Nazi signs anywhere. Say hi, Denise. Hi. There's Denise. <laughs> so there's zero Nazi signs. There's zero F words. There's zero middle fingers. And yeah, that's all it is. There's just a bunch of people here that are celebrating the Southern heritage and honestly, United States heritage too. And nope, nope, that isn't good enough for these people. They call us fascists, but yet they do fascist techniques themselves. Okay, they are Hitler's brown shirts. If they bothered to look at history, they would understand that they are Hitler's brown shirts. And what they really would love to understand and do a little bit of research on is that when the brown shirts amassed too much power, Hitler had them all killed yep. in the Night of the Long Knives. So for any Antifa that might be watching this, or Black Lives Matter, which by the way, Black Lives do matter, we never said they didn't. They matter equally to every white life, and every Asian life, and every Jew life, and every other life. But they seem to think that we're all racist or something, I don't know. Anyway, my buddy Sacconi, my buddy Johnny, my buddy Tom, I guess they would all, they would all think I'm racist too. Uh, even though they're all black as coal. And John, of course, you know, but in any case, black lives do matter. All lives matter. These people are just here holding up a flag and celebrating this, st this statue in America. This isn't a different nation, this is America. And yet, we can't venture outside this fence without fear of getting killed. That's what we live in today, folks. This is what the midterms are all about. This is what 2020 is all about. If we do not put a stop to these people, 
we have lost America. Amen. I'm going to quit ranting for a little while just so you guys can see it. Make sure you get a good picture of the crowd. Look at how many police have to be here. Yep. Just Everything to make sure you see that we is in the yellow is police. I know it's hard to see, but... Go home racist. Even though this is our homes. Yes. This is the thing. Yes. I'm from North Carolina. This is my home. But yet, it's go home racist. So what do I say to them? Go home? Well, no, that's the thing. They have every right to be here just like we have every exactly. right to be here. They are misinformed. They are undereducated. And they are honestly sad human beings, but they have every right to be here. They're uneducated. Think about that. They're on a college campus and they're uneducated. Yep. I brought the flag if you want it. I brought the flag if you want it. Well, they do go to Carolina. They, can't, they don't know that much. I said they do go to Carolina. They don't know that much. Don't yell at Debbie about the uh, Denise about the camera hanger and it's tape while you're on the call getting paid to a check. Look! <laughs> Hey everybody, he's he's holding a, a, a live feed for somebody else. Well, I'm taking a live feed of him. <laughs> See, if you listen to their chants, they are they are so in sync that they must practice for hours, and it's so hilarious that they think that people don't know. Like, they literally have to practice. Yeah. No, USA. No, USA. Y'all hear that? No, no USA. USA. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They, that's exactly it. What they just said. No, USA. That tells you everything you need to know. They don't want America anymore. Hey! Done! I keep going through here. I do. I would love to I do, but I know they can't. Do you hear me? If anybody I feel sorry for here, it's the cops. And I really do wish I could talk to them, but I know I can't. Look, look, our cops at work protecting us. See? They're, 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 they're the barrier. They have, they have no, they can't say anything against it. They can't say anything for it. Whatever their opinion is, they have to be silent. Exactly, Trey, I agree. Look, let me see. There you go. Come and take it. I don't know if you guys can see it. There you go. Come and take it. Love always wins, but yet they're the ones that are shouting at us to leave, and they're, they, I, I, it's absolutely amazing to me. Look at our crowd, guys. Look at our crowd. Look at our crowd. This is our crowd. All right? I say ours, but you guys know I'm here as media. But these are the people that are locked in the fence with us. Look at us. Look at how peaceful we are. Look at how unhinged they are. This is Trump derangement syndrome, folks. You're seeing it firsthand. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I feel bad for every one of these guys. 
Yeah. That's what I just told him. I said, I know y'all got to really love here in the tent. We ain't hate God. We don't want no God. Even if they wanted to speak for it or against it, they can't. Yeah. That's all I get. I'm ready for the payment. The payment and everything. The teeth. Yeah. That's what we try to do. That's all we're trying to do is just teach. That's it. Well, see, I'm ministering through FEMA. And now I'm talking about every pastor. Yeah. April said Obamacare doesn't cover TDS. Say <laughs> so what? Oh, One of our viewers said. Hey, they're going to stop anybody else. They're going to make it down the hill. All they're going to do is work right. That's it. The government wants them to think they have to have that, that, that welfare check. Yeah, and that's the difference. That's the difference. They believe that they're owed something. We don't. No. You earn what you get. The only thing we earn once we brought into this place is to die. To go in to go back in the ground. Melissa said they need different meds because what they're taking isn't working. No shit. The radio I'm with her. All you gotta do is laugh, man. It's just it's like, oh my god. I know you look a little wet. I'm sweating, that's all. I'm yeah. homeless, man. I just sweat at the drop of a dime. I, I sweat when it's cold outside. <laughs> Redhead. We can't control our body temperature. Well, with me, I turn bright red. Everybody's like, oh, you see it? I'm like, I'm yeah. fine. Yeah. I'm like, I'm fine. I promise. Oh, this He's like, he's, you know, should have had some fans. <laughs> Amazing grace. All of a sudden, just an amazing grace. Yeah, we should. We should. I've got, I've got plenty of black folks. Yeah, where's he at? We are not Nazis. We are not uh, fascists. We are not racist. They, if they bother to do any bit of history, uh, learning oh, from history, would understand that they are acting just like the brown shirts. And they'd be, they'd be interested to know, I think. Even yeah, the brown shirts. When Hitler thought that they amassed too much power, killed them all in the night of the long night. Maybe they should wonder who their hey. masters were. Really hey! Hey! We should all sing Amazing Grace. Oh, absolutely. Thank you. I don't know if you guys want to pass it along. Great to breeze, yeah. Great to breeze, yeah. Woo! Yes, I'm waiting. I'm, I'm, I was relieving her for a second. I was trying to get her to tell the guy with the bullhorn. <laughs> oh, this is AC right here. <laughs> this is AC right here. I wonder why you guys are hanging on. <laughs> here, you hold. Thank you. Oh, here we go, some more. They're going to chant at the cops. Look at this. Look at this. They're chanting at the cops. I welcome every single one of you that's here on the channel right now. I thank you all for being here. And, and make no mistake, guys, if you can, make sure you head over to Ted C Media. That's uh, Facebook.com TLC808. TLC is all capitalized. We're going to sing Amazing Grace here in a second. All right. TLC 808, make sure you drop a like and a follow. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. Make sure you guys are liking and sharing and getting this out there. This is what we are facing. This is what America has turned into. Thank you, Obama. Thank you, Clinton. Thank you, Soros. This is what America has turned into. But you know what? As long as they're brave patriots like these right here, America's not dead. Amen. We need more. Did you want to say something on my media page here? Uh, my name is Brent Summers. I'm with the uh, Catawba River Militia. Catawba you got to speak Patriot up. There's no way they're going to hear Catawba River Patriot Outreach. And we're here at the Silent Sam pedestal.
to support our history and our heritage and our right to be here and our right to our rights to come out and say how we feel, explain how we feel, to do it in a nonviolent manner and, and just to be here calmly, peacefully and try and put our message out while we're being shouted down, heckled, cursed by other groups and we're just showing that we're above that. We don't have to stoop to that level to get our message across. Amen. And we're here to support our history and our past because we do, though we may not agree with every part of our past, we have to remember the past if we don't want to end up repeating it and going through things that we know were wrong. Exactly. And things that needed to be changed. Exactly. And this monument was not a monument to invoke rage or anger towards slavery. It wasn't promoting slavery. It was a monument to students that went to this school who served in the military, right. who felt the call and left school to go fight in the war. And this statue was erected by uh, the alumni and the, da the Daughters of the American Confederacy. That's right, the Daughters of the American Confederacy, yep. And students. That's a mouthful, ain't it? And, so, <laughs> and the school. So the fact that it was torn down is, is sad and it should be punished because it's not just like somebody ran over a sign or something like that. They destroyed a part of our history. They did. A part of our past. And it's something that can't be replaced. It can be, a liking can be put back up of it, but it will never be the original. Right. And it can't, once you've taken that away, it's over. So. Now, what's your name again? Loud. So Brandon they... Michael Summers. Brandon I'm Michael with Summers. the Catawba River Patriot Outreach. All right. Thank you very much, sir. All right, folks, so there you go. I mean, we're still here. We're going to be here until 9.30. So as long as you're willing to watch, we're willing to keep taping. This is what's going on. Right now in the middle of Antifa, bro. Sorry guys, I had to PM one of my buddies. Let him know where we are. We are safe, just letting you know we're safe because of these brave men and women out here that are putting their lives on the line for us. These police officers that have taken their own lives into their own hands to make sure that we are safe. That's why we are safe right now because this crowd could overrun us easy. It don't matter how many badasses we got. It don't matter. They could overrun us easy. Not only are they shouting us down, they're shouting the cops. They are. They're telling. They're telling them to stop uh, serving uh, the Nazi masters and all that. Thank you, Jay. We we respect all of you that are watching here too. God bless all of you as well. She's got a camera friendly face. Make sure you get. Her. I got her already. <laughs> <laughs> that is Heather. I got those. <laughs> And here's the thing. Look at how beautiful. I don't know if you can get that building in the background. Look at how beautiful UNC at Chapel Hill really is. And it has to be disgraced by these scum. Flowers for the statue. Yeah, they've laid flowers down there. Yep. I'm sure they're loving all the close-ups of me. I'm trying to. <laughs> Me and my sweating face. I'm trying to get around. Yeah, no kidding. Dang, you already forgot my name. Hey, God bless you. There's a reason.
want everybody to take notice of the signs. You have Black Lives Matter signs, which is fine because they do. You have burn down the America Khan, which is not for the KKK. It's to burn down America. That's they what even that chanted, is. chanted, no more and USA. And then right there, you have anarchy. That's their true goal, folks. They want anarchy in America. They want no law and order. They want to run the streets by mob, mob rule. Yeah, I know it's hard to see, but they are pretty deep. I don't hear he won't do an interview, I know that. I know oh, he won't do some yeah. Here, they're to go the folding of the flag. Now, does anyone want to take bets on if my car still looks like it did when I parked it when we get back out there? That's another thing. Just so that you guys know, I just went over to a police officer and thanked him, and they all said that you know, thank you for saying that, and they appreciate it. But, no. oh. Yep. Come to the monument. All right. All right. So they're going to go in front of the monument here. I'm going to kind of take a position off to the flank here because I'm filming. It's everybody's history, you're right. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, what? No, she's doing it for them. Oh. You got it? You got it? This is the crew. Look at them. It took just us little bit of people. I know the light's behind, but you see us? Enough. You gotta have your voices heard. Huh? Amen. Gotcha. So pass the word around and then. Put him on the back of a truck. 
Good looking, I guess, if you're into that look. He's and, hiding and, right now. And he's the privilege. But he's yelling at us for privilege. Where's that marker, honey? Check one of my pockets. Back pocket, side pocket, somewhere. See, look, look, look. Look, see? They got a curse to try to make their point. I forgot, Derek, don't kill me. I don't think he heard you. <laughs> I want all of you guys to make sure you like, you share, you follow, you uh, all of it for Ted C Media. We need to get the word out there. It isn't just about this, although this is very important. It's also about unity, unity of message, unity against this madness. That's exactly right. Unity against, unity against this unity. madness. It's Unity it's, against it's backing ignorance. up the blue that are here to help us. They're putting their lives on the line to make sure that we're okay. I don't want to hear one word about cops anymore when it's negative. And it wasn't the cops that had the, the, the statue taken down. It was the city. Okay? It was the city. It was the officials, not the cops. All right, we're getting ready to go, so this is going to get hairy. You know they're going to they're going to think this is their last shot at us. So make sure that all the females are in between all the guys. I don't think they're going to do anything, just in case. You hear that? You hear that sound right there? Yeah. Now these guys are, I mean, and they can't do anything. But you hear them? You see the idiot with the bullhorn? Everybody just out of Come on, come on, come on. Let me get that on camera. Oh, they're rocking movies. Low kisses. Look, they're 
sitting with us. Of course they are. Now this is where it could get interesting, folks, so stay tuned. Yeah, the same crowd on both sides. But I'm not worried about them. Yes. You guys too, make sure you're protecting all your heads.
how the hell are we getting to our cup? Make sure that Celeste gets in her. Nobody left behind. Nobody left behind. Thank you. Seriously. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We ain't done. We gotta get out of here. Thank you. 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 Thank guys so we've been escorted off we're going to hop into the car here um, give me one second let me find Ted so that he can do some closing statements all right Bob. make it hop in hop in um, pop the trunk. Oh, he's got you? Okay. Well, it doesn't matter either or. It don't matter. Pop the trunk, babe. Take the uh, thing out. Give me that. That's in this pack, that seat. Here, take the phone, close your statements. Let's go, and shut it down. Okay, let's go. All right, we got to go, guys. See you later.